Good morning, Minecraft gamers. Welcome back to another exciting episode of Fun with Flapjack Hardcore Minecraft. All right, I know I did a beach already, which ended up looking a lot like a desert, but uh, I wanted to go ahead and do a desert biome just to check it out and see if it was any different than the other world that I played in. You know, it had a lot of ships that showed up, so I was wondering if in the desert lakes biome, if around the lake areas there might be pirate ships and I also wondered if maybe in this world there couldn't possibly be some villages so I thought I would take a quick look around and try to discover if they do in fact have villages in this world or if it's just going to be a bunch of sandy desert hills so far looks like it's going to end up being a bunch of sandy desert hills and I honestly am not seeing any lakes what in the world yeah as you travel along you do find a lake it's kind of a neat world uh, for a desert at least no wood of course and being that this is not a badlands biome there won't be abandoned mine shafts right at the top of the world I don't know that I've ever read or heard anyone say that we lose our food saturation far quicker in a desert, but that's something worth looking into. Not saying it's true, just curious. Now this is a nice big lake, too bad I don't have a fishing pole. Fish for some codfish or some salmon, but yeah, this is basically just like a dead sea, a dead lake, nothing here. We could potentially find what we need down. Oh, yikes. That is terrifying looking. How to get down there. How to get down there. Let's break this. Yeah, okay. Yep, okay. He's blocking the road, but it looks like this is a dead end cave, anyhow. And here comes Mr. Creeperton. Mr. McCreeperton. Hi there, Mr. Creeperton. He's like smiling at me like, he's like, what are you going to do, son? All right. Oh, no. Oh, <laughs> oh, that was bad. That was bad. I got stuck on the block behind me and he blew up in my face. So basically this round is over. And interestingly enough, I think the Desert Lake will be a very difficult world to survive in compared to most. My powerful stick of endurance. We'll see. Ooh, he sounds like he has asthma. I feel a little bit guilty beating him up. Come here, Spencer. This is going to take a minute. But we're not in a big hurry, I don't think. If that little bunny rabbit would hop over here, I'd whack it with a stick, too. Maybe eat some raw bunny rabbit. Ooh, yummy. I don't think that's healthy, is it? I don't think that's good for you to eat raw bunny rabbits. Creepers, too, because I can't take the damage that I would suffer. Mr. Creeper? Oh, no. Here comes Mr. Spider. Mr. Spiders can swim... That's not too good. That's not good. Go away, Mr. Spider. I hope there's no one behind me. Okay. Let's go. Oh my gosh. Here comes Mr. Oh no, Mr. Spider can jump. Yikes. One and a half hearts. Yeah, this is not going well. Not at all. Yeah, one heart. Woo, we're rocking it now. We're rocking it now. Let's get that. That's interesting. Oh, there. Finally killed that spider. Okay, Mr. Steve. Oh, yikes. 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 No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No. Oh, shot by the skeleton. I could not get away from him. Okay, so this is really cool to know. I think I'm going to class the uh, desert lakes as a very challenging world to survive in. So I'm going to have to add that to the list of difficult biomes. And revisit these. I'll revisit like the you know the three to five really difficult and challenging worlds, and maybe actually showcase trying to play hardcore mode and survive in those biomes specifically, like I try to do in Stone Short biomes. So yeah, hey, thanks for watching. I'll catch you in the next biome. <laughs> 